Is this window seven? Yes. I'm afraid something rather complicated has happened with my driver's license. I'm sorry to hear that. <clears throat> what happened? Well, you see, I moved here from another state and I let my license lapse and... Should I wait for you to finish? Um, I don't think so. It's a very long book. But are you listening to my problem? Uh, I can read and listen at the same time. Go on. Uh, oh. Well, uh, anyway, I took the driving test again, and I passed it, and I got this temporary license, which is now expired, and I've never gotten my permanent one, and when I called about it, they said they had lost me in the computer, and they had no record of my taking the test, and so... They couldn't send me my license, even though I did take the test and I did pass the test. Your turn to say something. Wait a minute. I want to finish this paragraph. Okay, so now what seems to be the matter? Well... Uh, in, in one sentence. I haven't received my driver's license. Okay, let me see if you're on the computer. I'm not on the computer. What is your name? I'm not there. How do you spell that? I'm not on the computer. I went to window three and they told me there was no record of me on the computer. I am not window three. I am window seven and I need to know your name. James Agnes. Uh -huh. So is that <clears throat> A is in Aardvark, G is in Gesundheit, N is in Nincompoop, E is in Excruciating, S is in Seltzer Water, J is in Jupiter, A is in Agnes, M is in Mary, E is in Excruciating, and S as in Slow Lingering Death. Yes. Well, you're not on the computer. I sure I wasn't. Fine. I'll give you an award at the end of the day. How else may I help you? I, I would like my permanent license. I'm sorry, there's no record of you on the computer. Yes, but I have my temporary license. This temporary license has expired. Yes, I know. It's expired. It is no longer a valid license. I know that. That's why I want a permanent one. And I you know, hadn't noticed that it hadn't come in until this one had already expired. I had presumed everything was all right. Hmm. What a funny thing to do. If you do not have a valid driver's license, how did you get here to the Division of Motor Vehicles? I took a taxi. Can you prove that to me? What? Did you keep a receipt from the taxi? No, I didn't. I trust you did not drive here yourself, did you, Mr. James Agnes? No. No, I realize my license is not valid. That is correct. You have an invalid license. Good morning. But you're not helping me. How may I help you? I want my driver's license. You must take the driving test. But I took the driving test. I have no record of that. I know you have no record of it. Some schmuck lost it in the computer. Kindly do not speak Yiddish to me. If you wish to make an appointment to take the driving test, go to window four. I don't want to take the test again. Well, when did you take the test before? 
It's the same as the date on my temporary license. Mm. <clears throat> February 3, 1894. The Division of Motor Vehicles didn't exist in 1894. Let me see it. All right, that's a typo. It's clearly meant to be 1994. I am willing to agree with you that it is more likely a typo. You see, I don't stick to the rules on everything. I am human. What's your name again? James Agnes. And a is in Aardvark, G is in Gesundheit. James Agnes! Oh. Well, let's see if <clears throat> we have a record of you on the computer. You don't. You don't. I told you, you don't. Why are you shouting at me? When I'm shouted at, I don't feel like cooperating. But you haven't been cooperating. I have been cooperating. If I had not been cooperating, you would have been shouting at me much earlier than this. <laughs> I want my license. Well, you can't have it. You're not on the computer. But that's not my fault. And it's not my fault. We're both blameless. Isn't that a nice feeling? You're not helping me. I'm doing everything in my power. But don't you have more power than you're using? Can't you, for instance, type me into the computer and then send me my license? No. <clears throat> Only the secretary of the driving test can do that. But when she forgets to do that at the time of the driving test, can't someone else do it then? If the secretary at the driving test is willing to write a note admitting she had forgotten to type in your name, then I can enter your name into the computer. And then we will fire her. Do you want her to lose her job? No, I don't. I want you to lose your job. I don't see how you can expect me to help you if you're going to be hostile. Isn't there anything you can suggest that will solve my problem? If you could relive the initial driving test, when it was finished, you could ask to watch the secretary type in your name and your test results into the computer. Your suggestion is that I relive the initial driving test. It's a hypothetical suggestion, I admit, but it's the limit of what I can think of to assist you. Can I see your supervisor, please? My supervisor is shredding documents in the other room and cannot be disturbed. Look into my eyes. I want you to tell me what I should do that will solve my problem. And I want you to tell me right now. Move out of New York. Oh. That's a good suggestion. Thank you. Ohio's nice. <laughs> 